but I could not sustain it for more than a week. The next week, Toastmaster Nirmit spoke about 30-day challenge. He told, if we do something for 30 days, it becomes a habit. So, for the next 30 days, instead of arguing with my spouse, I hit the mute button and gave him a patient listening. So, the arguments reduced, the fretting, the fuming, and the furies reduced. I stopped, <coughs> looked, and listened at him. Believe me, it worked wonders on our relationship. Do you know that world's most number of divorces happen because one or both the couples don't listen? So, being in mute can reduce the divorces. That's the power of fitting mute on ourselves and, and giving someone a patient hearing. Celebrate mute. It is good to turn on mute during those conference calls. It is better to turn on mute on ourselves and give someone a patient hearing and it is best to turn mute on ourselves for some time in a day. Steve Jobs muted himself during difficult times. He was very much renowned for taking long walks to think things through. Believe me, world's <coughs> most extraordinary ideas come out of silence. So, dissolve in silence for few minutes a day and you will, meet, you will never be the same again. You will become the most creative person in the world, most intelligent person in the world, most wonderful person in the world and you will soar to new heights. The best we can do, the, the, the least we can do is being silent for one minute daily. Have you heard about the application called Infinite Minute? How many of you? Thanks. Thank you. 